Welcome back to the channel. Just another update on why I think Novonix is still going to go well. So if you watched my past videos on my Investing Light channel, way back, I don't know, but there was no, I've got Novonix videos here. How lithium buying battery works. Battery day, no mention of Vonix, silicon anode. So all these videos tell you that Novonix is building a battery. They burn the graphite that goes in the battery, and Tesla. Come back to QuantumScape in a second. So Tesla is ramping up production of this battery, which is going to have graphite and silicon in it. So Novonix is still going to go strong. They want to get 10% of the market in America. And with that 10%, they're going to make, who knows, 500 million a year. And the market cap is around 500 million, or it'll be a bit more now. The price has gone up a bit. Here, where should we find it? 425 million. So I think they're going to be making that a year in profit once they get to 100 million, sorry, 100,000 tons of graphite which they want to get to by 2030 so obviously before they get there because stocks go ahead of what happens so if you can see what's going to happen in the future the price is going to go up before it happens if you didn't already know Tesla for one so if you bought here you're just going to have to hold and wait I thought it's overpriced price for what they like here the risk for was good for what they've done now because remember they haven't got to 100,000 tons yet they're only at 2000s, so they're building the stuff to get there and here, probably should have sold out but this is hard because I think it's going to go up to $7 around here and then once it gets there they're also going to reinvest that money they get and uh, do more things with batteries so where we go to Tesla and if you watch this video QuantumScape pullback almost certain one week ago let's look at this five days one month so one week ago roughly here it's gone down I knew I should have shorted the stock 23rd December what's today's date 4th of January so roughly here it's gone down a lot because QuantumScape all they have is a pouch and it's not in production yet and they aim to make I don't know, if you look at the figures, I'll bring them up. QuantumScape, show growth. See, all they have is a thing in a lab, they haven't put in a vehicle yet, so there's very high risk. That's why I thought they're going down. And Vonix, on the other hand, they're building something that others are ramping now. So Tesla's ramping this up. Also, go the limiting factor. That's the other thing risky about batteries, there's all this new technology always coming out. But I'm quite convinced on Avonix because they've got the silicon's gonna make some of the anode, but to watch the limiting factors videos, the silicon is gonna be 30% and the graphite will be uh 70% of the battery. Of the anode, sorry. So the graphite is still gonna go there. And that's the way I see it for the next 10 years. And that's all I got to say.